So at the onset, I would like to uh, raise a question, what can a Poland, which is a non-Arctic country, contribute to the global uh, Arctic uh, heritage? And we've heard actually pre um, uh, just uh, previously that uh, we have a long tradition of um, Arctic uh, research. We are present in the Arctic for over 85 years. We have uh, and beautiful, two beautiful anniversaries. Actually, we have uh, 60 years of Hornsund uh, Arctic Polar Station, but we also have 40 years of uh, Antarctica uh, Alstovsky Station. So uh, we are present for quite a few years in both regions, uh, north and south. And um, an Arctic uh, research has become actually uh, an important element of Polish heritage. And it is also an element of the uh, scientific uh, diplomacy agenda uh, based on the continuous presence on uh, Svalbard in the high north. And uh, currently, uh, our government is supporting strongly all the experts uh, in their activities and uh, <clears throat> various international uh, initiatives and committees that play a sig significant role in. Uh, designing the scientific and uh, political agenda in the polar regions. The ministry also uh, established the national roadmap uh, for research infrastructure, which is uh, consistent with uh, the S3 uh, target projects, like the Svalbard Integrated Earth Observating Systems as, as one of the most uh, prominent. Uh, we also invest in uh, the plan for um, polar pole program on uh, developing Polish multidisciplinary laboratory. As you just heard, there are places for PhD and uh, master students uh, in that laboratory. Uh, and we, uh, that also includes, the, the funding includes uh, three large projects, Hydra, Cryodyn, and Climef, uh, that have stable and uh, quite generous budget. But lately, um, Polish ministry conducted close and dialogue among all the stakeholders uh, in polar research and uh, the society uh, together with the ministry outlined the vision of polar, uh, Polish polar research strategy which reinforces Polish uh, part that is already been done uh, and the presence of uh, Polish researchers in uh, the north, but as well as south uh, regions. Uh, it is targeted for building also the Polish uh, image on the international scientific stage and provides uh, ex uh, expertise in the industry field also in uh, several uh, areas where uh, innovative techniques and uh, technologies and materials are um, in place. But it is also uh, quite important to stress the uh, social uh, part of the polar research. Uh, last night we've seen a beautiful uh, session on movies, on the research done in the uh, Hornsund and other Polish Arctic stations. And there is also humanities and social studies present there. And last but not least is um, the community involving process, which uh, we are also stressing the uh, education and outreach activities are quite important for us. So the goal of the polar, uh, uh, Polish polar research strategy is to uh, identify niches that and enable future development of Polish, Polish research in Arctic and uh, region. And uh, we pointed out a few areas, of course, this is quite uh, broad, uh, just like more in-depth knowledge about the abiotic components of the polar environment, uh, cryosphere, oceans, atmosphere, and landscape, and lithosphere, but also the ecosystems uh, in these uh, areas, so the marine, terrestrial, and uh, cryospheric ecosystems. Very important in this strategy, uh, and it is underlined, is the better understanding of determinants, trends, and uh, consequences 
of the presence of humans in uh, Arctic areas. Uh, and um, therefore, the social sciences and humanities are present in our research agenda. Uh, we are focusing also on new materials as uh, Arctic areas are, might resemble the one that are uh, used in space research uh, and uh, um, astronomical observations. Uh, but when we are talking about social uh, science social responsibility, which I already uh, mentioned previous uh, a few times, we uh, focus on the STEM teachers, we focus on the teaching uh, children at school, and I'm proud that the project presented uh, last year during the first Arctic science uh, ministerial meeting in the White House, Edu Arctic still is one uh, of the most important projects. And I will, as it is the topic of the next session, I would strongly re recommend uh, the, that you attend this session because this is a quite unique uh, um, example of um, uh, cooperation between higher education and uh, the schools. So uh, I would cordially invite all the interest parties to participate in the future dialogue and enhance bilateral cooperation and utilization of the polar. Uh, Polish research agenda uh, and I'm convinced uh, that we are all sharing here the goal of disseminating Arctic issues worldwide and raising awareness of the Arctic issues as they might play a huge role in our future uh, climate changes, uh, ecosystem changes in our life. Thank you very much. <laughs>